But besides nitrates, what else is it good for? Let's say it's Sunday, Sunday Funday Water Change Day, in my case, and you use this hack and you test your TDS and it's much higher than every other Sunday. Well, let's think. Did you see a sick fish and dose some medication? Did you find a new product and wanted to try it, so you added it to the tank? Did you have a little slip of the wrist and maybe fed too much food one or two days during the week? TDS is gonna tell you that something changed that week. Something caused you to have more dissolved ions in your tank than usual. If none of the above happened and you're absolutely sure that you didn't change anything all week, you may wanna search for a dead fish, or dead plants, or trap particles of food somewhere. My point is, keeping track of your TDS, as easy as it is to just stick that meter in the water, it's a great way to quickly tell you that your tank is right on schedule and nothing out of the ordinary has happened. Now, this doesn't mean that you can't ever change a thing or try a new product or add some more fish. No, not at all. It just means that at the beginning of the week, you should take a new base level measurement and expect your end of the week measurement to adjust accordingly.